वेलकम टू माय चैनल सुभाष सार्स क्लासेस दिस वीडियो इज मेंट फॉर क्लास टेन एंड वी आर डीलिंग विथ एरिथमेटिक प्रोग्रेसन लेट अस स्टार्ट विथ व्हाट एरिथमेटिक प्रोग्रेसन इज वी नो दैट एनी सीक्वेंस विथ ए फॉर्मूला जनरल फॉर्मूला ए एन इज गिवन बाय the set of all the natural numbers so you can find a1 is 1 a2 is 2 a3 is 3 and similarly an is n and all these form a sequence so we write them as 1 2 3 4 4 and so on till n this sequence is known as sequence n we have already discussed this thing in our earlier classes now we are going to find the nth term of a sequence since the first term a1 is 1 here a2 is 2 here a3 is 3 here so what would be the nth term nth term is n so how can we find this how to formulate how to make a formula say the first term is 1 the second term is 2 which is 1 plus 1 the third term is a3 which is 3 this is 1 plus 2 and a4 is 4 which is 1 plus 3 this we can change as 1 plus 2 minus 1 into 1 where the common difference d is a2 minus a1 or a3 minus a2 which you can find one equal to 1 so if we take this formula 1 plus 1 this is 1 plus 3 minus 1 into 1 this can be 1 plus 4 minus 1 into 1 so if a5 is taken as 1 plus 5 minus 1 into 1 then a n should be 1 plus n minus 1 into 1 what is 1 here this is the first term so we can write it as a plus n minus 1 into d so this way our nth term becomes first term plus number of terms minus 1 into d the common difference where d is equal to a2 minus a1 or a3 minus a2 any two consecutive numbers difference of any two consecutive numbers will give us the common difference d so if we just take another sequence like 3 5 7 9 and so on what is d here what is a here what is the nth term suppose you are asked to find the 20th term so we take here 20 the first term here is 3 and the common difference is 5 minus 3 or 7 minus 5 or 9 minus 5 which is equal to 2 now let us put the formula an is a plus n minus 1 into d so it will be 3 plus 20 minus 1 into 2 so 3 plus 19 into 2 which is 3 plus 38 which is 41 so nth term of this sequence is 41 so for a sequence in ap we have the last term or the nth term equal to first term plus number of terms minus 1 into the common difference d this is the formula let us go for the second formula the second formula is for the sum of n terms which is taken in two different ways n by 2 into a plus l the most common method divided in india and the other term the western method n by 2 2a plus n minus 1 into d let us try to understand why this formula 
how this formula came into being suppose we take 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 this is a sequence and i have to find sum of these seven terms 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 plus 6 plus 7 first i ask myself how many terms are there answer is 7 how many pairs 7 by 2 why do i take a pair see the add the first term and last term you get 1 plus 7 8 take the next two 2 and 6 add them this is also 8 take 3 and 5 this is also 8 and take the fourth term from this side and fourth from that side means 4 plus 4 it is also 8 so each pair means sum of any pair the first uh, first from the beginning and the first from the ending they make 8 the second from the left and second from the right make 8 the third from left third from right make 8 the fourth from left and fourth from right also make 8 so we understand that sum of the terms at equal intervals from both sides sum up to a particular value so how many pairs are there we have the one two three and a half pair so we have seven by two pairs and each pair sum is eight so simply we can put this into a formula that take any number of terms find the suppose n terms are there take the number of pairs so n terms make n by 2 pairs each pair make some value a sum the sum is first term and last term so take a plus l so this will give us the result so for this problem we have the pairs is 7 by 2 into first term 1 plus last term 7 so we get 7 by 2 into 8 so so it is 28 so we can find sn sn is n by 2 into a plus l is equal to 7 by 2 into 1 plus 7 is equal to 7 by 2 into 8 is equal to 7 into 4 is equal to 28 this is the way let us check it for some others suppose we are to add 1 plus 3 plus 5 plus up to 99 you have to find sn so how do i find what is the value of n because 1 to 99 all this project this uh, sequence this series is found to start with 1 and end with 99 but there are not 99 terms because see in the second term is 3 so here a1 or a is 1 and a n is or l is equal to 99 if this is the nth term we can say a plus n minus 1 into d is equal to 99 that means 1 plus n minus 1 into the common difference is 2 d is equal to 2 here so into 2 is 99 so 1 plus 2n minus 2 is 99 that means 2n minus 1 is equal to 99 so 2n is 99 plus 1 which is 100 that means n is equal to 100 upon 2 which is 50 so we have to find sn s50 so s50 should be equal to n by 2 into a plus l so n is here 50 50 by 2 into first term is 1 last term is 99 so 25 into 100 so this will be 2500 so with this we find the second formula sn is n by 2 into a plus l which is apply it can be applied very easily so what about the second formula why that came into being 
see we know that l the last term which is a n is given by a plus n minus 1 into d and when we take a is equal to a 1 is equal to a so we have a plus l is equal to a plus a plus n minus 1 into d so this makes a plus a 2a plus n minus 1 into d so we can clearly know that n by 2 into a plus l is the same as n by 2 into 2a plus n minus 1 into d so this makes the formula for sn so that's why this same problem can also be treated like this s 50 is equal to n by 2 means 50 by 2 into a or 2a 2 into a means 1 plus n minus 1 is 50 minus 1 into d is 2 so this is 25 into 2 plus 49 into 2 which is 25 into 2 plus 98 so 25 into 100 it is 2500 this gives the same result so this is how we use both the rules the nth term l is found by a plus n minus 1 into d and the sum of n terms of a p found by two different ways n by 2 into a plus l or <laughs>